Hello guys, once again it's Matt and today we have another video, thank you all the members of the Patreons, make sure to subscribe and let's get into it guys. So today I wanted to talk about this, RWRs again, because I saw a lot of people having troubles identifying some targets in the digital RWRs, okay? So for example here in the F-16, but there are many many aircraft that have this, uh, we have the two S6 appearing on the RWR and each type of vehicle, if it's an aircraft or a, a ground vehicle and anything like that, and even naval, will have a specific code on these types of RWRs. And some people just noticed, for example, TRF, what is TRF? HRR, what is a HRR, you know, TRG, ADS, all of these codes on the RWR with basically don't have a way to know because Gaijin doesn't implement it, um, didn't add it in the F1 menu yet. Uh, they will probably eventually do it, uh, but it is not added yet. And Jaek actually did a very, very cool, um, you know, table in Reddit that we can check it out and basically talk about it. Uh, he is a YouTuber as well, so go out there Check him out, I will leave the links in the description for, for both the reddit post for the table that I will show to you guys and the, uh, his channel as well. He does these amazing like explanation videos that he does. It's it's pretty pretty cool and he's not doing this uh, for too like uh, for too long, you know, he, ch he started not too long ago and he already is growing very very like in a very very fast way and you can see why if you check the videos, you know, uh, it is a very very uh, concise and simple to understand videos, uh, very well edited as well, uh, he will go far, I think, and I hope, <laughs> at least, uh, so yeah, thank you, Jaek, I, I, I say Jaek because it's, I'm Brazilian, so it's how I pronounce that word, but um, uh, you can check it out and see for yourself, okay, so um, leave uh, a subscribe on his channel, and let's just hop onto it and I will explain a little bit of how the table works. Okay, let's go. He's saying over here that for digital RWR, so uh, a lot of the American ones, like for example, this one is for the F-16. We have some of the Chinese ones. Uh, we have the SPO 150, which is the uh, Pastel, for example, which is the uh, one in the SU-39. And it should be the one in the SMT as well, but it's not added yet to it. And some others, just the most modern RWRs that you will see. Basically, that's it, right? Of course, there are some others that are a little bit less capable, so, uh, for example, um, the F-14s one, or even the MiG-29 one, uh, they don't actually tell you what aircraft or what vehicle is trying to lock onto you, right? They are just going to say, oh, it's uh, an aircraft or a uh, ground radar or something like that, right? But for the ones that are actually digital and say the, the actual, um, you know, vehicle that it's trying to lock onto you, uh, you can use this table. Okay, and by the way, they basically say that some of these are not in the list. So, for example, the Kronos 2000 APG-676, the J7E Type 226 and everything like that. Some of these will appear as a question mark. So, if you see a question mark, it means that it's a, a vehicle that it's... Uh, the RWR doesn't know what it is, and it's probably one of these, for example. Okay, so let's just go with it. So, as you see, MiGs are very, very much um, an easy, you know, way to look into it. So, MiG-19, it will be as M-19, um, but of course the LIM as well, um, or any MiG-17 or 19 that got a Raider, the J-6, um, for example, uh, any aircraft that got a Raider of the RP-1 or RP-5 nature, so the LIM or the MiG-19s, um, will have a designation as M19. You will not see this much because it is a lower BR, but still. Uh, MiG-21s will appear as M21, so I think only the MiG-21s use these radar, so uh, yeah. M29 will appear as MiG-29, so both the original N019 radars and the SMT's radars um, the Raider, the, the Zook, will appear as M29. And an interesting thing is that the original Zook used in the Yak-141 will also appear as an M29. So, Yak-41 and 
all the MiG-29s will appear as M29 on the RWR, okay? Uh, the M23 as well will be the MiG-23. It's not here, but uh, the Sapphire 23 Raider, right? We have the F3, which will be the Demon. The F8 will be uh, some form of Crusader. F5, obviously, some form of F5. F14, one of the F14s. F16, obviously, the APG-66 or APG-68. It means that any aircraft that use these, both of these Raiders will be identified as an F-16. That includes the F-4 EJ Kai. So all the F-16s plus the F-4 EJ Kai will appear as an F-16 on the RWR. The F-18 mark will appear on the RWR when the APG-65Q appears, which is uh, only used in one aircraft right now, which is the AV-8B+. It is the same radar as the F-18, and that's why it appears as an F-18. It's not really an F-18, obviously. F-4, the Phantom. Of course, any of the radars, older ones like the F-4C one, and I don't know what uses this, actually, but uh, the APQ-100 and 120, so the F-4C and E, uh, and the APG-59s, you know, all those radars uh, will appear as a Phantom. 104 will be the Starfighters, so any of the Starfighter Raiders. Uh, TRF, this is one that a lot of people didn't know what it meant. What is TRF? Well, it basically is a Tornado F, you know, so it's a Tornado Fighter. Uh, so all aircraft that uses the Fox Hunter Raider will appear as a TRF on the RWR. HRR, Harrier, okay, so any of the two C Harriers that got added. Um, one of them was already in the game, but still, the two C Harriers um, that we have in the game will appear as an HRR. TRG, so this would be a Tornado Ground, or G, uh, which is the GR1, or the IDS, right, will be appearing when uh, the 23274 radar appears, which is the Ground Radar slash, um, you know, aiming radar of the Tornado GR1. So... TRs are the tornadoes, okay? So TRF, it's a fighter tornado, and TRG is the ground tornado, if you will. <laughs> 40, 50, it's the Votur that have a raider, so the two ends, right? M3, always remember, M will be for two aircraft, basically, you know? For the Mirages and the MiGs. So if it has two digits over here, it will be a MiG. If it has only one digit, it's a Mirage. That's pretty much what you see. So M3, Mirage 3, any of the uh, EBS or Serrano 2 Raiders. MF1, Mirage F1. Remember, these RWRs are detecting the Raider, not the aircraft. So if any other aircraft uses any of these Raiders, it will appear as another thing, okay? M2K, obviously, Mirage 2000, the two, the RDI and the RDY uh, Raiders. A32, of course, the Lansing. J-35, Draken, obviously, J-37, the Vegan, the J-7 uh, will appear as the J-7D, apparently, uh, I don't think the other one, the aiming radar of the other one, the J-7E, will appear, so, um, yeah, if a J-7 appears, uh, it appears as the, uh, it, it is the J-7D, okay, it, the J-7E will appear as a question mark, normally, unless this get, gets updated, both the J-8s will appear as J-8s, when appears a missile, or I saw s in the dev it was some of the RWRs uh, appeared as ARH. So I don't know if everything is MSL right now, uh, but basically if you see an MSL, it's a missile, or ARH, it's a missile. So it's a Phoenix, basically. It's a Fox 3 missile, right? The only Fox 3 missile that we have in the game right now is the Phoenix, so it will be a Phoenix. So watch out. S-125, of course, the Volna M SAM site, uh, used in the Bravi, uh, it's the Yag Yatagan uh, Raider, but is, it is used on the um, on the Bravi, so we will not see this, this Raider too much. RLD, the Rollins, so it always comes down to a code of the vehicle or a abbreviation of the name of the vehicle, right? So, for example, Tunguska is 2S6 because it's the code of the vehicle, but Roland doesn't have a code, so it's just named as Ro LRD because it's a, an abbreviation of that. 9K3 is the Tor, S1 it's the Panzer, P1 
PJ9, which is the PJZ09 of the Chinese tech tree. The ADETs, it's the ADS. The ASD is the Azarad. So you can see that the AA systems will be the hardest one for you to understand. Uh, the SNL, for example, Santal, CRL, Crotal. I mean, all of these, you will take a little bit of time to get used to it when you are seeing. You might just be like, well, what is that? You know, the, come on, what is that? Because an aircraft, you can, I mean, the Fs are very, very uh, easy to understand. The MiGs are very easy. The Mirage is very easy. You have the tornadoes that you have to notice what it is, TRF and TRG. But everything else is pretty easy, J35 and everything. But the AA systems, it's just abbreviations, as you see, unless it's a Russian one so uh, or a Chinese one. So Adats, Azrat, Krotal, and Santal. So we have to worry about these ones to get used to it. And the Roland, of course. And then if it appears as an AAA, I mean, it can be basically any radar AAA system. So... Uh, you will see that for some of the Russian ones, some of the other ones, Gepards and stuff. So all of those triple A will appear as triple A because they are an artillery, right? Technically. And if it appears as NVL, it will be naval, basically. So any of the naval raiders will appear as this. Okay. You might see this together with this afterwards, uh, if it's the Bravi, I would say, but it depends. Probably it will appear just an S, uh, as an S-125, okay? So, yeah, very, very cool to see this. Hopefully this was helpful, and I see you guys on the next one. So, bye guys, see ya, go out there, follow uh, Jack in YouTube, and go in this post and upload this, because it's amazing, it really is. Thank you, Jack, for doing this, and I see you guys on the next one. Bye guys, see ya.